Hey readers, welcome back. Today's story will be Look at Me by Robert Munch. Look at me. Look at me by Robert Munch. When Madison's grandmother came to visit, everyone decided to go for a walk downtown. In front of City Hall, Madison said, Look, 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 I found a ticket, a ticket for free face painting at the park. Neat, said Madison's grandma, let's go to the park. At the park, Madison got in a long, long line. A girl came and said, get a scary face like mine. No, said Madison. A boy came and said, get a tiger face like mine. No, said Madison. A girl came and said, get a butterfly face like mine. No, said Madison. Finally, it was Madison's turn. I want, said Madison, just on my cheek, a small, perfect rose that looks really real. Really real, said the face painter. Really real, said Madison. And the face painter spent a long, long time painting a small, perfect rose that looked really real. That's a nice flower, said Madison's dad. Now let's go look in some stores. At the hardware store, when her father was looking at drills and saws, Madison whispered, Daddy, I think my flower is growing. That's nice, said her father. Daddy, whispered Madison, look, look, look. Please really look at me. My flower is growing. There was just one rose and now there are two. Madison's father looked very closely at Madison's face and said, Why, there really are two roses, one on each cheek, but I think it was that way already. At the kitchen store, when her mother was looking at pots and pans, Madison said, Mommy, my flower is growing. That's nice, said Madison's mother. Mommy, said Madison, look, 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 please really look at me. My flower is growing. There was just one rose and now there are three. Madison's mother looked very closely at Madison's face and said, why, there are three roses. I thought you just asked for one. I did ask for one rose, said Madison. Well, I guess that face painter gave you three, said Madison's mom. At the ice cream shop, Madison said, Grandma, my flower is growing. That's nice, said Madison's grandma. Grandma, said Madison, look, look, look. Please really look at me. My flower is growing. There was one rose and now there are 24. And I think a leaf is growing out of my ear. Then Madison turned over her arms. Ten roses were growing down each arm. And while her grandmother looked, another rose grew on the end of each stem. One rose was nice, said Madison. Twenty-six is too many. This is serious, said Madison's grandma. She picked up Madison and ran down the street to the doctor's office. The doctor was no help. She said, I know a lot about people, but I, but not a lot about plants. Let's try the garden store, said Madison. At the garden store, the man behind the counter said, weed poison, check out our wonderful weed womper. Ah, yelled Madison, no weed womper. I know, said Madison. Let's be nice to the rose. I will go home and take a nap with a large flower pot beside my bed. And maybe the rose will go and live in the flower pot. When Madison woke up, there was a huge rose bush in the flower pot and just one perfect rose on her cheek. Madison's grandma took the rose bush home and planted it in her garden where it stayed until it found a better place to grow. <laughs> the end. Thanks for reading with me today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.